Easy game. Oh, and it's it's also yep. lane pressure, which is huge. Pick. Yeah, yeah so exactly. Warrior. Makes their uh, lineup maybe a little more high tempo and lane and making sure that there's not going to be any rotations towards mid. So even though Fata, you know, he hasn't died. Oh, oh that cast. Oh, the Sonic Wave. See ya. As Triple C showing his son fell swoop. So crazy. That is pretty ridiculous. Oh, okay. I think he's dead. Oh, nice blink. I don't know. I think MSS might be dead now. To be honest. He's trying to turn on Fade. It's not going to work out. S Triple C has gotten like the awkward. Like three heroes at like 1800. Ay. And then somehow again, newbie still have like a 2.4k net worth advantage. It's so this weird. Is queen is like all of their net worth advantage. Yeah, it's, it's a significant amount. Envy's gonna get chunked down by Moogie. Gonna go for the battle trance. And Faith has been like owning with these. Faith, of course, also with an Invis rune thought about going with the cask and Maledic. He's not quite level six. There it goes. They're trying to find Envy. Now they drop down. The infest bomb's gonna come out. There's the battle trance, the shadow word to come through, and Envy is getting destroyed. Fata needs to be careful. He will have that remnant out. It's like Owie could be in some trouble here. Knock out scouting it out. Cast. Get a tail. Do they have enough damage with Malik? Oh, yeah, they do. Oh, my God. Nature's intended. No way. Cocky even gets to the last little impetus going into KP. This guy's starting to get some room to farm. He's actually almost caught up to AUI. Meanwhile, the Impale mid. The Warlock, I believe, is absolutely 100% dead. As Triple C will find a dominating spree and multi. I have already used cast, but bottom lane. All right, here we go. TP's coming in. They can't find somebody. The infest out. AUI 2000 looking to try to get away here. He does have a TP scroll. They have vacuum, though. The Surge, the open wounds. AUI 2000 is absolutely done. Moogie will get the kill. Spada is going to walk up. All right, let's be careful here. See if NT can't move around. Look, shot's gonna go through. They're gonna find Faith. They need to bring him down. The is going to work, and he's in trouble. And Will Yule's up. This uh, Fata Ember is gonna try to chase after the Wild Wing. Okay. There's just follow up damage or lockdown. Again, they have the Orchid as Triple C thinking about going in. But there is a Yule Scepter for Fata and Envy going to work. This is actually a serious amount of damage. They have the Golem, but not enough mana to use. Now they do. I don't know, all of a sudden, newbie, I don't, they're, they're taking a lot of damage here just from like Fatal Bonds alone. MSS is gonna walk up Cogs, they're gonna be there. No Cog push, here's the Battle Trance. Meanwhile, Pilot Eye gets the kill on Kaka, and this is gonna be taken down. They're gonna try to find more. Faith is gonna get caught out, the Revenant through, and he's gonna get caught again. Two dead, they get Roche. Huge. TP, and he's fine. No Impale. Oh, he canceled it, that's awkward. Oh, Owie. <laughs> and then Faith already has Medallion Urn, which is pretty damn good, I would say. But here we go, Smoke with the Sea Gang coming in. They'll find the Queen of Pain. He's in some trouble. Triple Remnant, the Golem drops down. What a turn! As Triple C will stay alive for now, but the negative Urn charge should take him down. We shall see if that's going to be the case. He's going to drop maybe. Can he get to the Shrine? He drops right underneath the Tier 3 Tower. Regeneration. We'll see. Just come through, running it in, they're looking for Kaka, Spike Terrible, there's the cast coming in, they find the uh, Death Ward as well. Yule Sister come out, MSS pops the blade nail, they're gonna push back now, Fata. Maybe in trouble here, he's not careful, they will blow up Kaka though with the... Oh, good vacuum, but no wall combo coming in. The Impet is still doing work, he's inside the Siege Creep right now, and Fata's still going on to this tower, the tier 3, taking a lot of hits and all over towards mid. The golem stun is really nice too because it, it can line up a hook. It can line up some oh, He's a little bit out of position here. He is way out of position. The remnant coming through. He's in trouble. He's gonna get dropped. Down for 48 seconds. Five, or sorry, 4k net worth above the next highest person in the game. That is nothing. He is a full item. Right? Therapist, Orchid, and Kale coming through. This is gonna be bought to dead. Sonic Wave back wall even dropped to get that kill. Mm, it's a vendetta, I believe, or is it a full smoke? Looks like it's a full smoke. As Triple C is going to push out mid. He's working on his Shiva's guard, and they've changed. Meanwhile, up towards the top area of the map, they're just not with everybody. Kaka's going to get dropped down, it looks like, and maybe KP will be next. That was a bit... Also has a TP, so he can get to the shrine and look at the fast. They have the Infest Bomb ready. Pilot out looking to counter initiate with the Golem. They should have the hookshot as well. Coming in, vacuum wall combination. They need to cast. He's going to go into MSS, and they'll keep him locked down. Meanwhile, BKB's pop. They really want this to change. And they will find it. Golem dropped down, but the blink is out in time. Buyback coming in from the Enchantress. 
Now KP getting turned on. Forced away the Bash, the Whirling Axes, the Ranged Axes, the Voodoo Restoration is not enough on the back side of the fight. Yule Sips are coming in. SCC and Mugi are kind of separated. They're trying to man fight this right now. They need help. Vendetta Impale grabs the kill. Now they find the Impale again onto AUI 2000. They want more damage coming in. SCC Shadow Strike going through. Envy doing some work. He's got the Mask of Madness pop. Here comes the Ancient Thunderhide. Trying to chase after AUI 2000. The open wounds. The huge come in coming from SCC. Throws up that Orc of Malevolence. Gets the kill. And that's exactly what they're going to do. That is insane. Oh my god. These bonds from Highlight Die. Envy going right in. They want to finish. Here comes KP. Looking for the vacuum. Cog pushes there. The BKB. They want to finish this. The bash is up though on Envy. And KP, he might fall, but will he get this Roshan? He's trying to finish it. Envy's BKB is done. Fox is back in. He's orchid it up. Hook shots come through. That'll stop Moogie. They use the upheaval. Pilot Eye in some trouble. Sonic Wave onto two. Pilot Eye will fall. The Impale remnant forward. Fox is trying to man fight here. Moogie's still at half HP. Now AUI 2000 on the back line. Getting caught. More damage from SCC. Running low on mana and the shrine to come through. They're diving up the high ground. MSS gets faith. And they will get Kaka as well. The orchid is there. They need the kill. The untouchable doing some serious work. They get Roche. They get the Aegis on the back lines and the cheese why were you chasing newbie that's not the play now they'll find the yule center not much mana left for sec they burn all the rest of it he cannot blink out now the infest out coming through moogie's gonna try to man fight at least spots but he's running and sec is gonna fall moogie is now the sole survivor he's gonna go for the tp will he be successful the battle oh trips the bashes are there <laughs> i cannot believe it just enormous Oh man, I feel like they have it and they keep throwing it, but there's the cast, the wall, the impale, but where's the follow-up damage? Maldic, the death ward. Golem dropped down though, and that'll be the end of the fight already. Newbie has to back up, the dust is gone, MSS, the battery is still coming through. He will back away, the tier 3 tower already done. KP trying to run and making it away, but the slide of fist brings him down, the glyph is there. S triple C is up in eight seconds, Envy going to work on the range racks, the impale will miss, they need to leave, they walk to the wall. Slows them down. Maledict will miss there as well. Faith walking out and NP are going to make it away. Pretty much got free. Although, well, uh, Pilot Eye. Pilot Eye is going to, yeah, he's, he's going to exit for a little while. And these fights go on long enough for MP that they can do the job. Kaka is going to walk up and they'll try to find somebody here. Courier is going to be taken down at the very least. Nice. All right, well, this here we is go. an open set of racks top, so yeah. this is going to be tough to defend. And with an Aegis and BKB for Envy. And vacuum back, doing some serious work, casting through good force away from that Impale. Then Impale hits, then that Aegis is probably gone. Still might be. The Orca comes out, and uh, he really wants his range back, and he's going to waste his Aegis for it. I shouldn't say it waste, he gets the actual building down, which is pretty huge. Now they're going to back up. You have people to cover the retreat as well, and now going on to the melee racks. BKB is available. And a burn to come through. I think you. And I don't think Fata is gonna. Well, maybe he will get BKB by the time the fight breaks up. But he's got oh, cheese anyway. Fate. Fate. They're jumping in. Sonic Wave coming in. Can they bring him down the force oh, away? They need a couple auto attacks. The cheese is there. And now Kaka will fall. They get the bash up on the S Triple C. He gets Golem down as well. Can he blink out in time? Cog push. Somehow makes it away. But now the Remnant will finish him off. A double kill for Fata. So is this a forced buyback on Queen? That's the real question. Because if you buy back now, and Queen doesn't have buyback for Roche, that is some scary stuff. You need to be careful with your MP. You can't go too far in here. Even if you want this buyback, I don't know if it's worth it to lose any couple heroes. They're going for it. You gotta be careful. Wall was already dropped down. You will step through the come through. And he's trying to fight this BKB will go. The hook shot is there as well. They found Moogie. He's in trouble. Disarmed. The time being, they cannot find the racks. Vacuum back into the wall. Time to leave. And Pale will miss completely. They're going to look for MSS. They will find him. They have the uh, Orphan Malevolence on him. They will get one more kill at the very least. Can they find Fata? They certainly cannot. He TPs away the Impale not in time. On cooldown for another two seconds. AUI 2000 might go down. Shadow Strike. There's going to be the Orphan coming through. Yes, SLC did have to buy back. But he does get a double kill at the very least off of it. Well, they have an Invis. And Kaka's Vendetta. So if they get a pick, it might still be enough. Did they even kill him? He is BKB. They found oh, Kaka walks into God. the sentry. He does get forced to the low ground here because the remnant though, and he's potentially in trouble. Problematic, I believe he is dead. Yeah. Oh, he's negative. And guess what? Roche is up. 
Hook shot coming through. They will find Faith again as well. He's going to get dropped just like that. They don't notice. Moving into the base. Here we go. KP on the front lines. He's got wall. Will he drop it? Maybe just walks up and Kale misses against Kaka. They will get off the cask and he's still just going to go to work on the back. Jump in, Kaka will find Fata. They will break the linkage here. Wall drop down on the back end. They go for a play, but now the Kaka come out from MSS. They drop the golem. They do blink away, but the disarm was there for S Triple C. They've already had to buy back on KP. Now MV kiting everybody, including Mugi, who now has to back up. 40 seconds for Faith on the back lines. Good back wall. And Pale to follow up as well. On to one. Jumping in as Triple C shows the Sonic Wave. The Sonic will come through. Can they take KP down for a second time? The Sonic Wave will come in. But again, the Aegis and Satanic both up. They're going to come in. They're going to try to fight this. They'll get AUI 2000 as well as Pilot Dai. Fasa forced to cheese. Can they bring Envy down? The Pale comes through. He's low. They cannot quite get him though. Now backing away. It's just, just still just the Aegis though. If they can bring him down. But it's not quite there. He's able to get out. Plenty of Maelstrom blocks from, uh, procs flying through, so I guess they're able to... You can lose the Aegis, right? Mm -hmm. He's just super damn tanky. Can't hit him. Well, so you gotta kind of kill everyone else. The good thing is they do have the MTB now up for... Moody. Fast will come through. Again, he still has Aegis. Searing Chain, Spike Carapace coming out. They really want this melee rack to stay alive. Constant pressure from MP might turn this into a building finally. Opening was coming in, the Impale. Hook set the fall from MSS. There's the wall dropped down as well. They need this kill onto Envy and they will drop him. It's just fun though. Now can they get MSS? Sonic Wave comes out. Beautifully done. Remed away from Fada. He can't stay to fight. And now Envy has to pop the BKB and run. It is a five second BKB duration. He needs to get out. Here comes Kaka. He needs to find this Impale. The rolling axis is Spike Carapace coming through. Where's the Impale? Why didn't he get stunned? Envy now turning up. Highlight Eyes nearby as well. Shadow Strike coming through. They're going to blow up one potentially AUI getting chased down. MV stunned up now, getting caught. Maledict is up, and here comes Boogie trying to man fight the Shiva's guard. He needs to hit it, and he will. And MV is gonna get dropped down. Newbie turn it around. They hold the building yet again. Bots is still there. They won't be able to grab him. But again, the big target is Envy. Drop huge, by the way. Oh Look yeah, they're smoked up. Here we go. Yeah. Kaka, they're gonna find Envy. Impale, he gets it off. Oh, Can God. they find this kill? Wall dropped down, the golem will keep him alive. He will have Satanical Pop BKB. Sonic Wave coming out, a lot of damage. Nobody dead yet, Fata low as well. Kaka might fall. Can they get anybody out of this for Newbie? As you see, they're turning on Envy. He's already popped the Satanic. Mugi coming in, the upheaval is owning. Here comes AUI 2000, they drop two. And now Mugi's gonna try to man fight. Envy's low, the Glimmer Cave comes in. They need more damage and they cannot find him. Mugi chasing after AUI, gets the bash off at the very least with the MKB. Can he find this kill? At least one it is. Meanwhile, on the other side, MSS is going to get dropped. The gem is dropped down. That's pretty big for KP. This thing. Can NP get another Aegis and Cheese? They will see that it's not up. Sled of Fist and Chain's Faith is like, please, God, no. Golem dropped down onto Kaka. That's not great. Shiva's guard in the back line. They are looking for Pilai Die. He is Glimmer Caped. He will make it out. Now Envy heading inside the Rose Pit. Pilai Die going to get dropped. Mugi will get the kill. On the other side of the fight, Faith, well, he's dead, but again, not that big of a deal. Sonic Wave coming out. They grab MSS. Now the BKB going for Envy. He's got to run. The Golem is down. S Triple C chasing him down. Blink forward. Vacuum misses. He's so fast. Kaka cannot find him. Faith will buy back. They need to take this, Roshan. No fatal bonds, Graskel. Okay? It's not up. Yeah, but look at bottom lane. Boss is going ham here. That, this is oh, a he really is. Faith. Get out of there, Faith. Don't die back. Photo restoration in the shrine. Can he get there? It's too late. And then he remnants away. This S triple S triple C is gonna walk in and decides against it and says, okay, well they're backing up now. Fata TPing in though. Kaka has to vendetta. They're gonna get the melee racks. He gets the full racks. Fata hit. Whirling axes will miss. Oh, the split push is real. NP doing everything to force this to game five. They get off the route, the hook shot. S triple C, the cock push, but there's the vacuum wall. They need the sonic wave. They need the ultimate. It's turning into a slideshow. Envy and Moogie are man fighting. There's the sonic wave. Can they get the skill? Another perfect liver cape coming out for Pile I Die. Can they find anything else? Everybody is low. They might find MSS, but that is going to be it. They will get the infest out to get the kill. The shrine, is it available? It Yes, I would like to kill you. No, apparently not. They're going bottom instead. Oh, God. MV Impale. They can bring him down here. The hook shot coming through. They get forced away. Now he pops the BKB. He needs the Satanic, and he's doing some work. Golem dropped down. MSS now turning on. Getting forced Moogie. 
absolutely right clicking him down, trying to get the kill. The remnant coming through. And they will get MSS, but they've lost two. Both supports dead yet again. The upheaval is owning. The Yule Scepter Lincoln Spear is broken. Now remnant in the way. Trying to find S Triple C and they will get the kill. All of a sudden turning around. Mugi is here alone trying to man fight this. There's the Shadow Word, MV now, getting chased down, but instead, it's AUI 2000 on the back lines. They want Fada, they can't get it, the cheese goes. Mugi's still trying to man fight, it's not gonna work, the vacuum oh, onto the high ground, but the remnant to the low ground, that's just Aegis. And now S Triple C, as well as the Light Stealer, the only two alive. AUI 2000 still up there. He's got a Hurricane Pike, he can get down in some uh, period of time. Now the Orc is coming through, they need MV another Glimmer Cape, and now MV thinking about going back in. Newbie in some trouble. They've got to back seconds. And, uh, well, we'll see if they can't take advantage. They actually see Envy. Impale is going to hit. Can they find this? They need the cast to fly up as well, and it will bounce. SCC is going to come through. They don't have BKB. Here's the Orchid. The Yule Sip going to come in. They're going to come through. Hookshot misses from MSS, but the Force away. Now they're looking for the back wall. They'll find it. Can they get the Impale off as well? He will. And now they're going to come in. Scream of Pain. Shiva's Guard Sonic Wave. They blow everybody away. MSS is dead for 80. They don't carry detection most of the time. And that makes it so those items like Glimmer just do so much. Here we go. Pops him. Each guard running away, trying to man fight. Here we go. The golem dropped down as well. Wall is there. Boogie trying to man fight. Open moves. Envy getting chewed down. The impetus sonic wave. Impale. Is this going to be a dieback? He's so low. They need to bring him down. He's not dead yet. One more auto attack and he will finally drop. Pilot die in the back lines. S triple C going to work. He is in some trouble. A couple more auto attacks will do the job. And now the second golem dropped down, of course, on the death. He will buy back for Fata as he also goes down. Now the top lane getting pushed in, as you can see the wave. 86 seconds without eternal envy. And here we go. Nubia are pushing it to the high ground, looking for this tier three tower. See if they can't get it. All right. Could this be it finally, Graskill? MP, they've tried so hard. They can't quite get it done, perhaps. One racks will be taken. The amount of damage they do to these buildings is absurd. Fata is actually in the base on the opposite side. PP trying to chase him down. Fata has to leave. He cannot deal with this. Now Rack's bottom will go as well. Roche is still up. Aegis and Cheese still both available. Now the Abyssal done for Mugi along with Bybeck still available. Can they get top? There's a tier two there. So at least they won't lose Megas. Sphere breaking. Fata. Getting stunned up, getting forced away as well, and now Nubi will make the smart play and back up. Can they get to Roche? What can they do here? They got the sentries, but there is a gem carrier, so all this stuff's just gonna get poked down. Here we go, there's a nice break. Sure is. <laughs> no creep wave here. The Kai push kind of. They're gonna try to fight this. BKB pop from MV needs to be careful. Oh, they're trying to lock down Moogie, but he's so tanky. Hook shot. Actually hits under three. Cogs will find Kaka. Remnant in. They're doing some good work. They dropped the golem as well. Looking on the back lines, trying to find MV. Man fight. There's the abyssal. The glimmer cape again from Pilot Eye. Once more. Nobody dead yet on the side of Newbie. Now Moogie trying to leave. He does not have his cheese. He's already used it. SCCC throwing up the Sonic Wave. Here we go. The Cog push from MSS keeping it in. S Triple C trying to man fight. Now trying to blink as well. Root the Hex. Can they bring him down? That's just the Aegis. And now they'll find MSS. But he is the one with five act. He's got it. And he'll use it. Nobody dead yet other than him. Everybody else backing up. All of these abilities being used. So like Pilot Die and Aoi are able to just do whatever they want. You know, they step behind the tier three tower. He's just throwing impetus, and then Pi gets like a free up people channel and some fatal bombs. Poor kid. And V getting a little bit, uh... Still going to work. BKB pops again. Mugi trying to leave. Now BKB is down. They've taken the two, by the way. So, you know, they're going in. They they have buyback on everybody except for the Nix Assassin. They're going to try to do this. And he's still going to work. Not much mana left. The bash will come through and they get the vacuum back. Now in trouble is Fata and MSS. Can they bring him down? Envy is dead and now it's up to Fata as MSS will also fall. Golem dropped on death of Pile I Die. As Triple C taking some impetus hits from AUI 2000, but he's out of mana. They're pushed back into the well. The Siri Chains will come through, but the racks should be finished off. Remnant Fata trying to man fight as Triple C might be in trouble. Blinks away. The wall dropped down. Can they kill Fata? He's getting low, but now the hex up. That'll be into Kaka. He's low. Impale does hit. They need this kill. The Cogs. Excuse me. The cast coming in along with the Shiva's guard. Fata will drop dead for 123. That should be it. Newbie, they will be your Zotac Cup masters champion.
very well deserved from Nubia as well. I mean, you, you can't really take anything away from MT. I think they played considering, again, it's a pretty new team, right? So, this is their first land, correct? 